a stranger's uh, uh, criticism like has very little to do with how you feel about yourself and in in the steps that you take to better yourself hey my name is Moses Jackson we're at the 24-hour fitness in Compton it's been different you know it's been different definitely um, more motivation like I kind of underestimated it honestly and once I got it done it kind of like motivated me to do other stuff um, um, for me it was like more of like a journey of realism um, so I started like being realistic with myself after I got that done like hey you know what else could I do um, I think uh, definitely confidence level um, and again initiative there was like a lot of stuff that I had on like my to-do list before um, like right before I got the session done I was like 20 pounds heavier um, I wanted to lose the 20 pounds um, but I just didn't want to and it was just like hey you know what I restarted initiative on like you know self-care and like taking care of myself and taking the next steps and just like evolving myself into like a better person and so you know after getting the procedure done you know it's like hey you know I started you know I already had a gym membership but I was like you know let me actually set a goal let me actually get something done um, the thing is I I kind of had low expectations um, going in at one point just because I was looking at other people. I was looking at um, people got services from like, from like other providers, other artists and stuff like that. And so I was just like, hey, this, you know, I was excited, but I didn't think it would like change my life um, as much as I did, as much as it did. Um, more so it changed my perspective. You know, change my perspective. It was just like, you know, there's a lot of stuff that if I was looking at myself that I could change um, years ago, you know, you know, hair loss, or anything wasn't wasn't one of them. You know, I wasn't getting like, you know, implants or anything like that. That wasn't that wasn't just realistic to me. Um, I would definitely say to someone who's thinking about it is keep an open mind. Um, I know it's a lot of people on Instagram, on Facebook. Um, when you see the ads, a lot of people are there. They're laughing, they're criticizing, and it's just like you know, a stranger's uh, uh, criticism like has very little to do with how you feel about yourself and in, in the steps that you take to better yourself. Um, so I would, I would say just be more proactive with it you know just don't just just have it as a thought it is more realistic um, um, it's it's just take the steps to further because I, I kind of feel like a lot of people will sit on a lot of I sit on a lot of good ideas um, and they never back them up they never reinforce them you know it's just like you know just taking the steps it's just you know if you're realistic with yourself and you make like a checklist off it was just like you know and you just start getting stuff done it's just like you kind of just associate yourself with gains with goals will actually you know be more proactive zeng smp is awesome you know they actually stayed in touch with me um, on instagram um, kind of tracked my progress with stuff that had nothing to do with micropigmentation but you can kind of see that it was because of my it wasn't solely because of my pigmentation um, but the procedure did have a lot to do with it um, so they tracked my success um, as far as like my career and stuff like that um, they were always um, openly communicative with me and stuff like that um, so and I'm I'm still a huge fan of the procedure itself um, when I forget about it there's someone who knows me or a complete stranger who reminds me so it's awesome